And then what's your general like day-to-day -day plans of getting to work and driving class cars apparently? Yeah. <laughs> everyone goes there. Let's make this car. That, that because it's quattro, it sticks. <laughs> yeah, so, so sorry, say that again. <laughs> well, how is your how is your day-to-day -day work? First thing is uh, we've got a Siberian Husky and a German Shepherd. Both of them are winter dogs and uh, they like to get up early uh, for a, a nice cold stroll in the winter sun. We're up with them at about 6.30 in the morning and then they we go for a park walk with them and then uh, after they've been fed it's time for me to get dressed. The longest part of everything is my hair. That takes about 15-20 minutes. Um, a lot of care goes into the hair. Then um, I have to do a beard oil and do a beard shape, beard trim. Uh, once that's done, I need to go to the closet and then I need to start with a particular item. So this morning I started with a shirt. I wanted to wear a contrast color blue striped shirt. This is from Savile Row in London. Uh, that, that is my base that I start with. Then I match it with the suit and the, and the tie. So the suit that I'm wearing today um, from uh, King's Tailors, it's a bespoke tailor in Mumbai in India. They do all my suits. The suit has a charcoal uh, block pin or a window pane as they call it and a slight red line. So because it's got a slight red line, I wanted to match a red tie with that. Today I put on the Alessandro Delacroix tie and I matched it with the Paul Main pocket square. My, my shoes that I got on this morning is uh, Loke, it's from England, it's the uh, official cobblers of the Queen of England, the royal family. That takes probably about 35-40 minutes for me to get ready, look at myself in the mirror going, you look like a million dollars today dude, you can go out working. This is an office park here in <laughs> secure office park, uh, we've got some really nice offices up here. One of the big reasons why we took uh, this, this particular spot is because of the outside uh, natural light and uh, natural beauty. Well, there's not just one, there's two. The one that's talking to you today is the business version of me. So I work in, in ultra high worth wealth management, it's the second largest independent wealth advisor in the world. Um, I manage the South African business for them. I'm also a wealth manager. I've got my own clients um, and we manage several hundred million dollars for, for those clients. And then I also am a chairman of our global investment committee. So how did I become like this? Actually by pure accident. Um, I left South Africa when I was quite young in search of the rock and roll dream. I moved to the UK and I was a musician for a good eight, nine years and did fairly well. Like any musician, you have to pay the bills. And it was only when someone gave me the opportunity in a finance company to just do a little small bit of work that I fell in love with the numbers. I realized I've got two skills. I'm good with numbers and I'm good with people. Eight years ago now, I walked into the world of, of uh, financial advisory and wealth management, started painfully uh, to, to, to learn. Um, I did not know what the difference was between stocks and bonds. But eventually I slowly got the hang of it um, and, and, and I realized that I, I'm very good at the, at the aspect of making numbers human for people. I am supported by an amazing team. We are very, very skilled in terms of how we structure our client's portfolio from a taxation perspective as well. And because we do good work for our clients, they always refer us to their networks of clients and that business has grown into several hundred million dollars worth of business um, for us that we manage now. So I don't make money in spite of my clients. For every thousand dollars that I earn, 
my client has either made or saved 10,000. And I can show them that, and they are very comfortable with me earning a decent wage as well. If we can help them minimize a tax bill by 100 or 200 or 300 thousand dollars, if I earn five or 10 thousand dollars because of it, no one ever complains about it. So yes, we get paid very well for what we do because we've helped that person. And I think anybody would accept that that is a, is a mutually beneficial ar arrangement. Sorry, it's mimosa time. No, no, that's what we know. <laughs> yes. Um, we we're celebrating a couple of things. Yes. Um, and, and, and we're not going to put this on the, on the camera. But firstly, we, we're celebrating um, the arrival of Bianca, but also yes. I've just passed her on the issued figures. I did actually see that yesterday, and I wanted to say so. Congratulations. Yeah. Yeah. I'm so happy. Finally. <laughs> He's going to have to find another big regular saver to beat you. Yeah. Please smile. Smile. Very nice. We did it from the free There we go. I'm glad because the smart Congratulations, Congratulations. Just, just welcome. Welcome, welcome, Bianca. Yes. Okay, right, so I'm gonna get cooking. Uh, this morning's breakfast that I'm making, I'm going to be making. Uh, bacon and egg sandwiches with HP sauce and some pork bangers on the side. I'm pretty sure it'll be good. Butter. Sort of calm down as well. So I'm just, just doing. Um, I think three. Check at those. That, that extra cheese can come, can come here because that's for the next round of eggs. 